Let's talk about the elephant in the room, or should I say, the robot. Everyone tuned into this Apple event waiting for Tim Cook to drop a chat GPT killer moment. Instead, Apple barely mentioned AI. They said Apple Intelligence gave us live translation in AirPods, sprinkled in some smarter fitness features, and called it a day. Because Apple doesn't want to fight the AI war on Google's or OpenAI's battlefield. They're not building a chatbot that accidentally calls you bestie at 3 a.m. Apple's play is subtler. AI that disappears into the experience. Translation in your ears. A fitness buddy in your watch. Sleep scoring that just shows up on your phone in the morning. It's not flashy, but it's sticky. It keeps you inside the ecosystem without making you feel like you're talking to Skynet. So, is Apple falling behind or playing smart? Depends who you ask. Critics say Apple's cautious approach means they're behind in the AI race. Fans say Apple is doing what they always do, letting rivals chase flashy features while they wait for the right moment to redefine the game. Remember, Apple didn't make the first smartphone, the first MP3 player, or the first smartwatch. But when they did, they set the standard. The truth? Apple is betting that people don't want AI as a gimmick. They want it as an invisible assistant that just makes life smoother. Less chatbot, more translator in your ear. Less hype, more health alerts that save your life. And honestly, that's the most Apple move ever.